you Taurians. I hope that you're having a beautiful day. I really do. Um, let's see what's going on in the energy. Remember that everything, that there may be some messages in here for somebody. doesn't mean it's for everybody. Okay, so take what you need to take with you and leave what you need to leave with you, okay? Leave what you need to leave here, not with you, okay? <laughs> Tori, I yeah, know I'm tripping. Uh, okay. All right. Spirit, I ask you to please bless my dear Torians at this time as I give the messages. May any blockages that are there, may they be removed. I thank you, Spirit, for the blessings. Thank you for covering them. Cover their health, their wealth, their homes, and the ones that they love. Continue to bless them. And I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, okay, okay. All right. What's going on, you guys? Okay. Let's see if we can get some messages out here. Spirit, what do we have here for Taurus? I feel I need to pull out. Okay, Spirit, thank you. We're going to pull out the... Um, Empaths and Empowerment. Okay, I believe that's what this is called here. I'll reach behind here. Okay. Yeah, that's what this is called. Okay. Let's see. Beautiful cards. Okay, I don't know why I felt I need to pull that for my dear Taurus audience. Let's see, Spirit, what do we have here for Taurus? What's going on for Taurus? That's a Taurus. What's going on for Taurus? I feel you guys are setting up some boundaries now. With some people, with your, with a... Shit, even with yourself, you're setting up boundaries for yourself, respecting yourself. Mm hmm. Okay, well, then get it then, Taurus. This is what I'm feeling. Let's see, spirit, what do you have for Taurus? What's there for my dear Taurus? Taurus crew. What would you like me to know, spirit? Okay, time to pull this deck. I look, I'm going to give you what I'm going to give you, what I want to give it to you, okay? So you better get over yourself here. And I'm like, oh, spirit, here we go. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay. Tap into your spiritual power. Reach out to a power greater than yourself to solve a dilemma. Stay open to his guidance in your life. So I feel that, Taurus, you guys have a lot of people that you feel might be against you. Okay, you feel like you're on a path alone. You might be around a lot of people, but you still feel alone inside. Don't. Tap into your spiritual power. You have spiritual guides that are willing to help you out with whatever it is you're needing help with. Okay. Let's see. Tap into your spiritual power. All right, let's see here. Let me get some of these. Let me get one. Oh, thank you, Spirit. Growth. Growth. Wow. Taurus, you guys are growing. You're growing and you're trusting in your intuition. Beautiful energy. So when you start trusting into your intu when you start trusting in your intuition, when you start giving into that and understanding, um, letting your angels and your guides guide you. Letting them be a part of your life. Letting them help you throughout things. You're going to lose individuals around you. Okay? I feel nostalgia here a bit. Like some of you are probably missing the old days. The old times when things were the way they were. But you're just wishing that you can go back and tweak some things. Meaning like some people. The way that some people would think. The way that some people would act. Okay, Taurus? You can't change anybody. But you have growth. You changed yourself, okay? You changed how you handle people. You changed how to set up your boundaries. And that's absolutely beautiful energy. Spirit, what else do we have here for Taurus? Okay, we have careless. I didn't see your worth until it was too late. You didn't deserve that. Would you forgive me? So somebody wants to come back in. Somebody wants to come back in. Somebody was careless with you, Taurus. Okay? 
and now they see it that you've grown okay that you that you that you let things you're letting you're letting things and people go that just don't serve that just aren't here for your growth you're tapping into your inner spiritual power okay and someone was careless with you okay they were, they were careless let's see what else we have here spirit okay unavailable i'm emotionally attached to someone else i didn't know how to tell you okay so taurus you guys a lot of you not all of you were dealing with someone that was unavailable emotionally they were attached elsewhere okay they were attached elsewhere they were careless and unavailable differences at the bottom of the deck we are just too different to make us work i didn't want to hurt your feelings okay somebody here it's like it's like somebody here, Taurus, had had dre dr took you for a ride, you know, at the time. Okay, feels like some from someone from your past took you for a long ride. Okay, and I feel like this was they were careless about it. They didn't think about anybody else's feelings but their own at the time that this was going on. Hmm. Spirit saying, tap into your inner, to your spiritual power, the growth that you have. You've outgrown this careless and unavailable person, okay? This careless and un unavailable person at the time. It's like this person here just did not have your best interests. Did not think clearly about who they were tri who they were messing with. You feel alone, like I said at the beginning. You feel a bit alone. It says I'm showing thing. I'm slowing things down. I need some time to adjust to the changes, okay? And then we have. Don't make things worse. Listen to what I have to say. Everything is not black and white. So somebody wants you to hear them out. I don't know. I think they're kind of being demanding about it. Like you have to hear their ass out or something. I don't know. Shit, I don't know, Taurus. But this growth you have, I don't think you've really focused on that. Somebody was uncareful. They were careless with you, and they were unavailable. They were unavailable, and at the same time, they were mistreating you. Spirit saying, tap into your spiritual power, okay? And as you've done that, I feel a lot of you have done that. I feel like a lot of you have done that. And that's caused somebody to kind of awaken now. Somebody's seeing your growth, okay? They're seeing you grow. Let's see here in the tarot what's going on, Spirit. What do we have for Taurus? That was a terrible shuffle. Okay, we can do better than that, Lauren. Come on now. <laughs> Yeah, Taurus, I don't think you're sweating this anymore. I think somebody's trying to come back around to to um to save face. Like they, they need you now. Somebody's like something didn't work out. Somebody chose something else. But as they were choosing other things, you were growing. Okay. What do we have for Taurus spirit? That's a lot of cards, so we're going to take the one that fell out. Okay, first, we have the Queen of Wands. You're standing in your power, Taurus. Okay, you're standing in your power. It says, nearly love you. And in the mirror, it shows she has this crown on. And in the mirror, it doesn't look like she has a crown on. It looks like she's being more, um, she looks in the mirror, it looks like she's just plain. But she really has a crown on. So what you're seeing in the mirror, Taurus, you gotta stop looking in that mirror and seeing just that. There's something very important here you're missing. I'm gonna be honest with you, Taurus. I'm not feeling this deck. Ace of Swords, those at the bottom of the deck here. I'm not feeling this deck for your reading. Why? I don't know. I just don't know, Taurus. I don't know why. I just don't feel that for your reading. Oh my, spirits say no. <laughs> you like it, Lauren. You like the color. You like the color of the deck, but no, sweetheart, no. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ten of Wands in the reverse. Taurus, you done put down some burdens. You done put down some burdens. Okay. Some that you just don't want to carry no more. Somebody else's junk, okay? And I think you feel a lot of more light. Like, you know, you feel more light, okay? 
You don't put down a burden. I think somebody's upset about that. What I say, somebody's upset. Now I got the six of swords in the reverse. Somebody doesn't want you to move forward. Okay? Or they can't move forward since you decide to put them down. See, they were unavailable. They were careless with your feelings. They didn't see your worth until it was too late. They want you to forgive them, which I feel that towards you have forgiven. But there's a cycle that you're closing out. Somebody doesn't want that closed out. They're not ready. Okay? They're not ready. Yeah, look at this. I said there's a cycle that's closed out. But they're not ready for that. King of Pentacles in the reverse. Got the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. Got the Five of Cups in the reverse. Okay, Taurus. It seems to me you have somebody here that was very selfish. You closed the cycle out on. Okay. Someone's not ready for you to go. They're not letting go here. Okay, this Five of Cups in the reverse. I see this as someone being very, very, very depressed. Very depressed because you closed out something on them. A selfish individual that didn't like to get share or give to anybody but themselves. They don't want you to move forward. They don't want to give to you and they don't want you to move forward. Okay? This is somebody that's not doing very well. That always needs to rely on you for everything. Mostly financial. financial, Okay? And I don't know. I feel like a bit of this person's ego. You would, you know, soften. You make them feel some type of way. Make them feel very special. Okay, they like that. The star, you heal from it. Two of Wands, you're making plans. You're moving the fuck on. The Death card in the reverse. This person hasn't changed. They haven't done much change. Could be a Scorpio. Okay, Scorpio's here. Could be another Taurus, a Leo, an Aquarius. Okay, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Aquarius here again. Then we have um, Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay, you're making plans to go towards another direction. I don't think somebody's looking at it like that, though. I think somebody's seeing it as you just standing around. And it's you're leaving something behind. You see the short stick behind this man? Male or female? Okay. You see that? It's like, no. What's this Ten of Wands spared in the reverse? You put down the burden of somebody manipulative. Let me see if I can turn up my light here. I know I can't turn up my light. I just gotta do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you're putting down that burden with somebody that just uh, a bit manipulative, careless. They didn't see your worth. Somebody with fake, fake emotions. Fake it till they make it. You put that shit down like a hot dog. Seven of Wands, clarifying the um, Six of Swords here. Okay, Seven of Wands. Whatever this person's trying to do to stop you from moving forward, it's backfiring on them. It's like somebody's trying to stop you from moving forward. Like I said, they don't want you to, they don't want to act right. They don't want to be, they want to be selfish, but yet they don't want to, they don't want you to move on. Hermit in the reverse, uh, clarifying the world in the uh, upright. Okay, well, somebody does not does not like being alone. Somebody's afraid of being alone. That's their fear here. They're scared of being alone. Somebody's afraid of shit. you shutting out a cycle and then being alone. They're always around a lot of people. People, this person doesn't even care if these people don't give a fuck about them. They're just around them just to be around somebody. Okay, Taurus. And I feel here that a lot of times this person was around. That's Virgo energy. Okay, I feel that... What I feel is that this person would be around people that don't even fucking care about them. They'd be willing to please and give them everything that they needed, but they were selfish when the connection with you. And now that you're making plans to move on, they still haven't changed, and now they don't want things to end. You're closing out a cycle here, a big cycle, and you closing this out is making somebody very depressed. You healing, making plans, and then they want to stop it. They don't want it to end seeing you heal and going towards something else. Look at you with the world in your hands. You're like looking in another direction. The world that you closed out. The world here. Up here that you closed out. 
You're ready to try, you're, you're ready to get the fuck up out of the situation. King of Pentacles in the reverse is matched with the temperance in the reverse. Somebody high tempered, somebody that always needs attention. They always need you to balance them out. Like I said, this was financially, this could be financially a uh, Taurus or this, this person just, yeah, they, they were a burden. You put the, you put it down. They got this king energy, king of pentacles energy, which made it look like they had it all together. They didn't have it all together. They weren't balanced. Okay. I feel this person just liked to please a lot of other people. But you would you would always come in last, as if you even come in as being pleased, period. But with that soft, kind heart, tap into your spiritual power, Taurus. Okay, the growth that you have that you have uh, that you have acquired at this time is helping you understand this person. It's helping you understand just just how much they ain't worth your time. Just how much time you actually wasted. Okay. But then again, Taurus, I wouldn't look at it as time waste. I look at it as time learned. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. The Seven of Swords. Yeah. Being sneaky. Like I said, it wasn't you that they were sharing with. They were very selfish with you. Very selfish. And this person's trying to block you from moving on. We've got the Seven of Wands above the Seven of Swords. Someone's trying to sneak back into your life and block you from moving forward. After you done already closed something out here, it's already closed out. They don't like it. Five of Cups in the reverse spirit. What is this? Queen of Swords in the upright. This is you setting up boundaries. Setting up healthy boundaries. Okay, you setting up boundaries for yourself. Okay, being stern, being firm in what you're saying and believing, Taurus. A lot of you don't have to say anything. Your actions are speaking, but this person's going to act like they're dumb to that, like they can't see it. No, 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 Taurus is just having a bad day. No, 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 Taurus will be back. No, Taurus is just, you know, just having a bad day. No, no, no way, no. They're in denial. Someone here is in denial, Okay. They're in denial. As you block out this burden, they're trying to block you from moving forward. As you see them as selfish, they're trying to sneak back in as if they're not selfish. This person's got a temper. Y'all dealing with somebody that's got a nasty temper. And they have not changed that. King of Pentacles in the reverse, this person's broke as hell, but they may look like they got diamonds, up above diamonds somewhere hidden. They don't. They don't. They sneak with that too. Seven of Swords. They don't give to anybody, yet they don't have shit to give for themselves either. They don't even care about themselves. This page energy in the reverse here, page of cups, is fake-ass emotion. You don't keep no fish in no cup, nasty. Period. You put that down. You block off these burdens. You block off these people saying what they gotta say. You're tired of being used. Somebody was careless with your energy, and they were unavailable. Okay, they were unavailable. You heal the star. Yeah, nine of wands in the reverse. You got somebody that just, as you're healing, Taurus, as you're healing, you got somebody that's becoming more and more promiscuous. That's what they're doing during their time while they're waiting. It's like they're waiting on you to come back. But you're healing Aquarius energy. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, don't have to be. But the nine of wands in reverse, to me, that means somebody that's just overdoing it. They're overdoing the nasty. Look, I'm just going to say Mick Nasty here, okay? Mick Nasty. They're doing a lot of different things. Drinking, sleeping with people, trying to find some way to get, you know, I, and I can't, you know, judge people for their, their recovering or whatever, but this is not recovering. This is somebody that's not healing. They're not healing. They're adding more body count. The body count's getting higher. The more bodies they lay with, the more energies that they carry with them. And they're all over the place. The horse is already dirty. He needs a bath. And so does this man, woman. And in the reverse, they ain't doing none of that. They're out there getting doing more than what they should be. They're, they're doing too much. Too much. What's this two of wands in the upright? The nine of cups. The nine of cups. You're looking towards your wish fulfillment, Taurus. 
You're looking towards your wish fulfillment. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. You're looking towards something that's more of your wish fulfillment. And you're going to find that. Because now you are the star. Someone's seen you as a star. But you can't come in to the star on this dirty ass horse with all these dirty ass people you've been sleeping and laying with. See, not everybody is a star. Not everybody deserves red carpet treatment and love and, and love and, you know, not lust, but love and companionship and, and put them up on a pedestal and look at them like they're a gift from God. They're a gift from God, all right. They done taught you something. And as you being taught this lesson, as you've been going through this growth, someone that was careless and unavailable, they're trying to stop you every turn they possibly can. The death card in the reverse spirit the six, the seven of pentacles in the reverse. You're no longer putting any effort into something and someone's not getting it. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with or could be another uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But you're not putting any more effort into something and someone's like, that's not denial. No. They're still thinking about me. We're still doing this. In their mind, they're planning a wedding and you're planning to pack your shit and go. See, those those are two different energies. You feel me, Taurus? Those are two different those are two different energies. That's something you getting ready to pack you packing your shit to actually get the hell out of something. It's already been packed. You got on the plane already, you gone. And somebody's like, No, no, they'll be back. They just went to go get some they just went to go get some extra clothes or some they'll be back. somebody's very in denial here. Somebody's very into now. The emperor energies here. Could be Aries and Taurus Cuspers. For some of you, but you're taking charge. This person's in this person being in denial is not gonna stop you from what you gotta do. Them not changing. You just not investing. You setting up boundaries. You closed out a cycle. You blocking you blocking out this person with with all these with all these these uh burdens all these problems they got a lot of shit that they carry and they have you they they look like they stand there waiting for you to take the bag and of course taurus you guys are very lovely and kind and you will do that but this time i just think that you decided to put it down because that growth that you've been having this growth that you've been having tap into your spiritual power okay tap into that very important very important as you're growing to tap into your spiritual side, your spiritual power, because you do have it. You do have angels that are protecting you, that are around you. Anytime you need them, you just got to call on them. Don't make things worse. Listen to what I have to say. Everything is not black and white. So somebody really wants you to hear them out. I'm slowing things down. I need some time to adjust to the changes. Somebody here is pretending like they is trying to get on your level. I'm trying to just slow things down. They're really doing dirty things. They're doing dirty things until you come back. Pouting for them. Begging for them. Whatever they want to call it. Whatever they want to call it. But they were careless with you. And at the bottom of the deck, we got the Six of Wands. After all this shit, Taurus, you're going to be successful no matter what. You're going to be putting work into yourself. And you're not going to be dealing with no more with no more manipulative energies. No more manipulative energies. No more backwards ass in dead end relationships and dead end things with people that just don't want to don't want to vibe with you. Okay, don't want to vibe with you. You're going to be in your empress energy. This is what you're going to be in. Page of Swords, and they're going to watch. They're going to watch and be and, and be and be and be restless because they don't want this for you. They don't want this for you like you want this for you. They want you to be stuck on them, okay? Tapping into your empress energy. In fact, there's an empress and an emperor, emperor and an empress here. You're doing something else. You're going towards something else. You're gonna get that. You don't get that empire, Taurus, that you want. Yep. As long as you stay focused, okay? Stay focused on the Eight of Pentacles, okay? Ace of Cups in the reverse. No. No more pouring out your cups, Taurus, okay? No more pouring out your cups to make other people more satisfied or more comfortable. We're not doing that no more. Staying out of connections that just don't end up being on the same vibe. Like I said, somebody's playing a wedding, somebody's packing their shit to leave. That's two different energies. Somebody's trying to plan something to go right and to go, and then somebody's, you know, doing something else other than what 
they should be planning a wedding with you or you should be planning a wedding with them. It's two different energies here. But then there's the Empress right here, okay? We already got the Emperor out here on the on the on the board. We already have the Emperor out here. The Empress is here, okay? It 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 really blows this out the water. This bullshit right here, this two of cups in the reverse. Somebody that's not seeing eye to eye. Then you got some page of swords watching you. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. That's restless, okay? That's restless because the whole time, King uh, Queen of Pentacles, you were the one that was providing all the caring and nurturing. And here they are, the King of Pentacles in the reverse. They had shit. To, they didn't have nothing to give. And they were mad about that. They, they're they pissed about it. So the whole time you're actually inside some type of competition with someone that you were supposed to be, you guys were supposed to be coming together to to learn things, to get things off the ground, to be a team. And this person was actually in competition with you. Jealous of you because what you had, that nurturing, caring, loving energy. They didn't like that about you, okay? They didn't like that about you. They don't have to say it. They say they're careless anyway. I didn't see your worth. <laughs> they didn't see it. I'm emotionally attached to someone else. I didn't know how to tell you. Unavailable. Let me get something. What's this unavailable spirit? The chorus. Yeah, look. Them feelings ain't that attached no more. They watching you. They watching you. Now look, we just fell out. The three of swords, the four of cups, the three of wands in the reverse, and the four of wands in the upright. See, I said somebody's planning. You're planning different things, Taurus. Four of wands in the upright. You're going towards something else. You're in your home. You're doing well. You're keeping your home up, okay? Even if you are couch to couch, Taurus, it does not matter. You're taking care of your own self. This is you taking care of you. Twin flame my ass. I ain't looking at no twin flame right now. I'm talking about yourself. Uh, you can look at your own body as the four wands, okay? Look at your own body, your brain, your mind, your emotions, your heart. Take care of that. Turn your back on people that just don't want to help you take care of it. You keep moisturing, you keep feeding their their egos and, and petting their heads and shit, but you're not thinking of yourself. Time to stop doing that. Stop taking any old offer that comes through. No. No, 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 mm -mm. Not going to do it. I'm looking for my counter. I'm looking for somebody that's going to match me. Not somebody that's going to bring me this damn cup, okay? And that fish is probably sitting up in that bitch again. And then they these are the same these are the same cups that this person's already bought to you. Three. Three cups before the same thing. Could have been three times you didn't give this person a chance to prove something. But you're looking at the disappointment. It's time to start looking at the disappointment. It's time to start looking at the disappointment and start looking at this cup right here. Start looking at this cup right here. Yeah, I know you don't want it, but this is a cup from the divine. Okay? This isn't from this person. The divine's trying to hand you something that you deserve. Okay, it might look familiar like these other cups down here, but this is coming from the clouds. This is coming from the hand of God. That's how you got to look at it. They're trying to show you, but you're too stuck on what this person's bought you before. You think that this is the same thing. It's not. It's not, Taurus. And you know what? Somebody's upset about that. They're in the Three of Swords. Because what you're getting offered is beautiful. What you're getting offered is something that you deserve, something that you can give and someone can give to you. And that that type of exchange, you don't pass that up. This ain't no um This ain't no uh we hold hands during lunchtime and then during recess we uh we kind of split our ways and you know, we ain't we ain't we ain't going together. That's what we used to call it in high school. <laughs> Back in high school, middle school. They going together. Everybody's like, What? They going together? Like that means you dating y'all dating each other, but this isn't high school anymore. This is grown life. This is life. You trying to set an empire and you gonna get that empire. And it's breaking somebody's heart. It's breaking it's breaking their heart because they know that you set for greatness. They know that you're made for greatness. And they sat there and was careless and unavailable. While greatness is right in your face, what are you to do? Somebody was unavailable probably because they were married. But now, they're watching you. They're watching you and they're trying to gossip and keep shit up in your life. Because they ain't got shit to do with it. Whoever they were emotionally attached to, emotionally screwed their ass over. 
okay? And now they're heartbroken because you are accepting. You're going to end up seeing this cup for what it is, a gift from God. You're going to stop waiting on this bullshit to change. Stop looking at it like them cups is about to start dancing. And you're going to see just what you're missing, what you need to be a part of, what you need to be a part of. It don't matter who's hurting from it. It's time for you to think about yourself, Taurus. It's time for you to get up in that four wands. It's time for you to start getting the house jumping. Stop going to other people's and trying to get to, get to jump for them. Start, stop being the life of everybody else's party and be the life of your own. Start your own. Start your own. This person was unavailable. Talking shit. They still are. Spirit, clarify this page of swords in the reverse for Taurus. Look. They still are. Their money's not right. Okay. Their money's not right. But we got justice here in the upright. Libra energy. Justice is on your side. Things will be made balanced here. Okay. Things will be made balanced. It's not up to this person if you walk away or not. No, it's not up to them. It's up to you. You get to decide. You get to decide. This person has no power. See, now here they come. They want to cooperate. They want to cooperate. Now they've made their decision. You see what I'm saying? Don't get it twisted. Don't let people tell you rats only eat cheese. They eat any goddamn thing. They don't eat any damn thing. They'll eat anything. Rats will eat whatever they can, whatever they can get their claws into. And that's exactly what this one's been doing. In everything. Gross. Any more messages spared for Taurus here? Any more messages for Taurus? The Four of Wands again. Taurus, I'm telling you. You're on the great things, my love. You're on the great things. Don't let nobody juggle you. Don't let nobody put you. Yeah, look at that. Don't let nobody manipulate you. Juggle you, manipulate you. Try to put you in third parties. Trying to sit here and mess with your independence. Okay? Your independence. Somebody's here trying to be manipulative and juggle. Who the fuck... Compared to this bullshit right here, look at this. The birds even come to me. They flock to me, bitch. I'm the bomb, okay? I'm the bomb. Skit, normally, birds are sketchy. They don't come and sit on anybody's hand. But the Nine of Pentacles in this deck, they sure was sitting around you, Taurus. They still are. pre synergy. Synergy. You're going to your, get your celebration on. You're going to get your life together. And that's exactly what you're doing right now. You're trying to build an empire. But be very careful with how hard that you're doing all this in. Okay? Because you're out of your head about something. You don't need to go back. Yeah, you're out of your head about some secrets. Some secrets and things. And they're no longer a secret. That's what's helping you move forward. You're healed from this bullshit. Now, all you got to do is look up and see that cup. Somebody's trying to bring their energy back in because they don't want you to see that cup. They, they want you to be insecure like them. Restless like them confused like them okay that's what they want now they want to reconcile now they want to come bring the cup to you and and cheer to the good life because now you're in you're in that part you don't got through the hard parts see they didn't sweat with you taurus they didn't sweat with you but now that you didn't taking a shower and stuff they want to love up on you oh no oh no look at this how am i supposed to get how am i supposed to approach taurus after all that i've done the careless uh, acts I, the careless energy I bought to the table, the unreliable energy, the unavailable energy. What do I do now? Because where I'm at, I'm not happy. That's what this person's thinking. Where they're at right now, I regret. Where they're at right now, I wish I never. I wish I coulda, woulda, shoulda. I wish, I wish, I wish. I wish I could bring this cup to Taurus. But this is a fucking night. You sitting here as an emperor. What the hell are you bringing me this shit for? Taurus, you like the emperor just will sit there and just knock that cup right out the way. Like, no. <laughs> I think not. I think not. I think I'm going to mind my damn business and keep it on and keep on going. Let's see. What's the tea? Let's see, spirit. You know, I have to break this, this deck down. <laughs> It's like, oh man, here we go with this. Two different, same deck, two different stacks. <laughs> Cause it's just so, it's, it's a big deck. Love triangle. Somebody wants to put you back in one. 
because they're dirty. You see this knot of wands down here? Same shit, different day. Same shit, different day, Taurus. Told you, this person's not changed. The only thing that's changed here is you're no longer investing. You're no longer, you see this as a bad investment. But they're doing the same shit, different day. That's what they're doing. Spirit, what else do we have here for the collective of Taurus? Windfall. Your money's going to come up, Taurus. Your money's going to come up. And this person's going to wish they wasn't careless. They're going to wish they was growing with you. Like I said, they didn't sweat with you. Oh, but now that you got that nice shower, you smell good. You look good. You got that fresh clothing on. You did all that hard work that day. Then nobody want to lick a piece of sweat off of you. Then nobody want to help get their hands dirty or, or muddy or nothing. But now look, this windfall's coming in. And here they come too. Here they come too. Let's get the other deck here. It's other side. Spirit, what else we got here? Gambler. They gambled you, Taurus. They gambled you and lost. They gambled you and lost. Now that the windfall is going to be coming in, Taurus, y'all about to get a windfall of money. Y'all are going to be so blessed. Let me go on ahead and check that out. Yeah, we got Moocher at the bottom of the deck. Look at that. Somebody's like, oh, damn, Taurus got it. Yeah, Taurus got it. Not your ass. Spirit, what's windfall here? What's windfall? For Taurus? Yeah, they're defeated. They're defeated. They can't take it. Y'all, I won't even be surprised if somebody's been getting some readings on you and been trying to find out your finan your financial uh your finances, if you're going to gain something, okay? If you're going to gain something, you've gained a lot of self-love. And now here's that Ace of Pentacles. That's what I was waiting on. That's what I was waiting on. This person feels defeated because guess what? That self-love you have for yourself, you're accepting it. You're accepting that self-love. And this Ace of Pentacles, this is a gift from God. Look at that big old hand come out the sky. That's why I said, Taurus, you got to look up. With that four cups... You got to look up. This person's going to be feeling defeated once this one fall comes in. And they're still doing the same shit different day. It's the same shit they're doing. But now you're loving yourself. Okay? This Ace of Pentacles is here for you. And you're wide awoke to who's been go who's been in the mud with you and who hasn't been. You're wide awoke to that. You're not silly. Okay? You're not silly. You're not silly. You're not to be pitied. Nothing. Hold back. Hold it back. Don't share not nada, nada. People that don't want to be inside the workplace with you or be there putting in that elbow work and stuff, but then they want to come and join you when the prize is there. No siree, no. I made a cake. Don't mean your ass gonna come over here and start. You didn't even want to put it in the. You didn't even want to preheat the oven for me. What the hell? You was too busy running off doing other things. Why? Well, guess what? I was healing. I was healing. I was getting my emotions together. And what were you doing? Oh, you're doing the same shit. It's just a different day. Circle. Same cycle. You see that circle going going round and round? Same deal. Nothing's changed here. Nothing's changed. I'm just not investing anymore. Because spirit is uh, tapping to your spiritual power, your growth. Don't feel alone, Taurus. You're not alone. You got money coming. You're not alone. I know money's not everything, but Taurus, third party relationship popped out. Somebody's trying to put you in a third party. Somebody's not willing to let go of a past of bullshit to be with you. They're not. That's why I said they're, this shit hasn't changed. The thing that has changed is you're not invested. Then we got the same shit, different day. It's still the same thing, Taurus. Ain't nothing changed. Home. What I say about the four wands. Be your home, Taurus. Be your home. Be who you are. Love yourself. Somebody, Somebody's seeing you as home, too, I'm hearing. But why? They don't want to act right. They don't want to act right. We got Snake. And then we got Player. The same energies here. It's not going nowhere. This person will bite your ass. As soon as you sit there... You think you bit, got bit once. As soon as you sit there and you turn your back, this person will bite your ass. They a player, they a snake, whatever they are. 
Grass is greener. For you it is, Taurus. For this other person, it's not. They're not happy. That nine of swords in the upright, this ten of pentacles in the reverse, this justice card here with the page of swords in the reverse right underneath un unavailable. They were unavailable. They wish they had been. They wish they hadn't have been. I'm telling you right now what I'm feeling, what I'm seeing here. Any other messages, Spirit for Taurus here? We haven't done a long reading in a while. Now you remain a mystery to this person and they want to know about you, Taurus. They want to know about you. You remain a mystery. Somebody's still stuck in memories about you. Memories in the past. They're not even... Somebody's stuck in the past. Stuck in the past. They stuck in the past. Yep. Yep, they stuck in... <laughs> they stuck in the past, Taurus. They really believe that something... Let me get... Um, uh, Oracle one or two. Come on, Lord. Oracle one or two. two, 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 two. Oracle one. Oracle one. Okay. Um, the hidden truth. Oracle. Let's get something from this, and we'll close this out, Taurus. If you alone now, Taurus. If you feel alone now, you won't be lonely much longer, Taurus. You got your spirit guides with you. The growth that you have, the growth that, that, the growth that you have attained here is, it's impeccable. It's beautiful. You were able to grow from all this. The carelessness that this person was, this unavailability, they're still snaking. They're still doing stuff. And then now they're trying to block you from moving forward. Energetically, Matt, doing Matt, whatever the fuck they're doing, Taurus. Continue to call on and tap into your spiritual power. You are powerful more than you know. And you got to believe it. You got to believe it. You have to. The Hidden Oracle. Let's see what's going on here, Taurus. I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. That's you, Taurus. That's you. A lot of you are really grateful for the spiritual lesson. That your spirit, what you have within yourself, is priceless. It doesn't come with a price tag. It does not. One more spirit from the spirit from the hidden oracle, please. For Taurus. I wish I could take back my words. Somebody said, somebody should have put this on the card. I wish I could take back my words and my actions. Because that's exactly what somebody wants, wishes they can do. But yet, I don't get it. They still want to be a snake. They still want to be player. I wish things could be different at the bottom of the deck. They still want to, like, play. I don't get... This person is a, a whole confused Taurus. And I would, I, would, uh, I would avoid it. I would avoid the confusion. You're not alone. You're not. Somebody that's careless and unavailable. I wouldn't stress and make them part of my time. That's for sure. But you have free will. You do as you please. But Taurus, know that loving yourself... You closing out a major cycle, okay? It's very, 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 very important that you watch how you open it back up if you decide to do that. Because snake and player is here, okay? Snake and player. The seven of swords is here. The temperance in the reverse. The king of pentacles in the reverse. The page of cups is in the reverse. Somebody here is so immature and they have multiple disorder. Uh, multiple personality disorder. They, they, they change up and down, and they mix drinking with it, and it makes it that much of a more of a disaster. Be careful, Taurus. Be careful. Somebody likes drunken sex sexcapades. That's what I'm feeling. I don't know where the hell that came from. Let's see this. Uh, clarify the player and the snake. It's the truth. Ace of Swords. That's the truth. That's exactly who they are. They're not going to tell you that, Taurus. And why they being unavailable around you and careless with you, they're careless and unavailable to other people. This person needs healing. They need healing. Okay? While you're clear on this, 
while you're happy and trying to move on with your life, remember that you've outgrown these games. You're too, you, you too, you're, you're too spiritually ascended for this. Okay? Send my love to you, Taurus. I know this was long. I know it was. I know it was. I know it was. Okay? But you, I appreciate you. You know, I, I really do love the fact that you come here to see and to listen to what I have to say and what spirit is bringing to the table. Thank you so much. Thank you. Gracias. Thank you. Okay, Taurus. Um, have a beautiful week ahead. Okay? Stay prosperous. Stay loving yourself. Stay growing and don't allow anybody to block you from your from your destiny. Don't let them do that. You're too smart. I know it. You're too smart. A lot of the Tauruses that I'm connecting with, very smart. You just have been, you got played while trying to be the kind, loving person that you are. Somebody, somebody took advantage, but that's okay. Spirit's going to give it all back. They thought they got away with it. No, they haven't. Okay, Taurus, have a good day, loves, and I'll see you next time, okay? Bye, Taurus.